Hey, Drew. Well, we're starting our descent to LAX, so... Uh, if you need to make the stinky lemonade or drop the Kardashians off at the pool, you better go now. Hey, Bob. What's your name? Where are you? Where are you going, Bobby boy? Another casino? My... My name's not Bob. Not a problem, Bob. Say, where'd they send you? L.A. L.A. Oh, what you doing there? Getting your tits enlarged? Getting your anus bleached? Hey, Bob, did you do the job? Did you write you-know-what on the wall of the shitter? It's supposed to be the Dallas airport. I got two layovers instead of one. Travel arrangements ain't an exact science with these corporate clowns. You're lucky you didn't end up flying standby again in the ass of a plane with an epileptic drooling all over your precious little beer hoodie. Hi, thank you. Oh, God, I sound like a woman. The captain has asked me to tell all you smelly coach bastards, please, scrunch your butt cheeks together and hold in all your nasty barking spiders. Oh, God, it smells like burnt kimchi in here. Oh, boy, we're landing. Oh, God, I hate this part. The last time we landed, I bit the inside of my... Oh, God, I spilled hot coffee on my genitalia! Please gather up all your shoes and your glasses so you have them. Where you gonna ride it, Bob? Here at the airport? Do what? I'm an engineer. I make software for a living. Yeah, bullshit, Bob. You're a clown. I think you should ride it someplace risky this time. Like on a landmark. You mean Deadwood? Oh, going back to Deadwood. Gonna make another shitty music video with an alien that does butt stuff to his? Shut up. I was bored last time. It was a creative... Outlet. You know what else is a creative outlet, Bob? That dipshit black Sharpie pen you got. <laughs> you can't hide from me, Bob. No, sir, old Bob. Don't even try. Where are you? Up your butt with a coconut. Say, Bob, you could use spray paint. I'm just trying to get to Deadwood. Imagine spray painting your child is bullshit. Leave all me alone. over Mount Rushmore. Uh, this is Captain Antonio. We have somewhat of a celebrity musician on board. This is Agnes Palestrina, just won the Guinness record for performing an elaborate modal melody using her own intestinal flatulence. She then won a second Guinness record by simultaneously performing a contrapuntal melody using her own queefs. Thanks for flying with us, Agnes. And say, do you take requests? How about doing banjos? When you upload those photos, Bob, what's the joke you write with it? From a Coen Brothers movie, right? I don't know what you're talking about. Don't bullshit me, Bob. I follow you on Instagram. Pull up your photo stream. Hashtag, old Buford is a sly one. There they are. Washington, Las Vegas, Philadelphia. In Uruguay, you wrote it in Espanol. Muy clever. El Bobo. That wasn't me. I don't deface property. I'm a, s a software developer. I know. Come on, Bob. Just try to remember the movie where you stole the dumbass joke. Perhaps this will ring a bell. How many Pollocks does it take to screw up a light bulb? It takes three. <laughs> Thank you.
Uh, this is Captain Morgan. Sorry, uh, the takeoff's gonna be a little bumpy. I had the jalapeno bean dip chowder at Cantina Laredo and four margaritas. I can't find my pants and my colon is in for some turbulence. Oh, 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 oh. Ha, <laughs> ha, Nice. Oh, I think I got some spatter on the altimeter up. Uh, wipe that off, Roger. Yeah, thanks. Uh, thank you for flying Air Biscuit. So we were doing paramedical work in affiliation with the state highway system. Not actual practice, you understand. And me and Bill were patrolling down nine miles. Bill Roberts? No, no, not that mother scratcher. Bill Parker. Anyway, we're approaching the wreck and there's this spherical object arresting in the highway. And it's not a piece of the car. So here comes Bill a walking down nine miles. That's Bill Parker, you understand. Got his sandwich in one hand and the friggin' head in the other. Come on, Bob, just say it. What did Nathan Jr.'s jammies look like? I don't know. They were jammies. They had Yodas and shit on them. Excellent, Bob. You're remembering. Did you ever notice? Old Buford seems to travel to the same place as you do. How do you know about Buford? <laughs> you're really delusional, old Bob. Maybe you're Buford. Who knows? As far as we know, there could be... Twelve Buford. <laughs> I hate you! You've sure gone tits up, Bob. You forgot to do the graffiti today, Bobby boy. I saw one, I think, at the Dallas airport. Saw one? Or did you make one? Who are you? Don't play games with me, Bobby boy. I know you carry a black sharpie in your dipshit camera bag. You have to be smart to get what you want. Tell me, what do I want? You want to write the word fart on public spaces and then photograph it. Admit it, Bob. That's what you want. More than anything. You got yourself a problem, Bob. Leave me alone. I completed my work assignment. The client was very happy. You don't belong in technology. Comedy and bullshit will follow you wherever you go. You know what they say, Bob. No. Old Buford is a sly one. No! Ah, ha, ha, ha.